right, got a uh, really nice cigar today, a uh, personal favorite of mine lately. Uh, this is another JFR, um, but uh, this is a very different uh, cigar than uh, a lot of other JFRs that I've come across. So this is the JFR Lunatic Ombre Libre. Um, much like the other JFR, I've already reviewed the Titan uh, Maduro. Um, if you go in somewhere where they have a lot of selection of the JFRs, uh, you'll see boxes and boxes of cigars that look just like this. So they've got the same uh, same golden wrapper on it, same exact band. Um, and for many years, um, uh, I had a, a local shop where they had a, a lot of JFRs. <clears throat> and so uh, I found a couple of favorites in there, smoked tons of them. Never ran across, th this was like hidden in, in the, uh, you, you know, off to the side. Just didn't notice it, it was like on a lower shelf. Um, and don't get me wrong, the other lunatics were fantastic. Um, but the Ombre Libre is spicy, peppery, just really tasty all the way around. Um, and I love spicy cigars, so uh, this is a great, great cigar. Um, so uh, the, the JFR, uh, this particular lunatic, um, it's, uh, it's another one, it uh, uses tobacco from the uh, Aganorsa uh, tobacco farm, and um, uh, I guess those, uh, it's Nicaraguan, tobacco but it uses like Cuban seed um, so it kind of harkens back to uh, as close as you can get to Cuban tobacco um, but uh, you can definitely taste a difference in this compared to other you know similar Nicaraguans so it's a Habano wrapper um, it's a Nicaraguan uh, long filler um, and this is a 6 by 54 so uh, it's a good gauge Sometimes with um, spicier cigars, you do get a little bit more taste out of the smaller gauges, as opposed to uh, always going with a, a big gauge. Um, so uh, anyway, let's get started. It's got the nice uh, golden wrapper on there. Um, other than that, I mean, very nicely constructed. Not a very oily wrapper, um, but uh, you know, it's kind of wrapped there at the end. It's not an even cut. Nice, easy light, good draw right away. Oh, but yeah, right away on the exhale. I mean, you really, you really pick up some of that spice, some of that flavor. Um, this is not a super spicy cigar by any means, but it, it just has a really good, smooth, um, slightly spicy, slightly peppery taste. And again, um, they make many different cigars with this exact same label. Uh, they all come in these big boxes. Uh, if you're not looking very closely, um, it, it just they look very similar. You know, if you're just grabbing them out of the box. Um, but yeah, Ombre Libre. This one just stands out to me um, from the many others that they have that look very similar to it. I believe this is about a, an $8 cigar uh, retail. So, all right, I'm going to keep uh, smoking this and um, check back in a little bit. All right, we're back with the uh, JFR Lunatic Ombre Libre. So, um, you know, just to recap, this is a uh, 6x54. Uh, it's a Habano wrapper and Nicaraguan uh, filler. Uh, uses Aganorsa tobacco, so again, that's uh, uh, like a Cuban seed tobacco. Um, 
and uh, fantastic cigar. Um, haven't had to relight it, very even burn, as you can see. Been smoking this for 40 minutes. Um, easily got another 20 minutes to go, so this will be a solid one hour uh, smoke. Um, and yeah, these are, these are fantastic. So again, <clears throat> uh, they make several cigars with, that look almost exactly like this, same label. Um, the Ombre Libre really stands out compared to the other ones. The other ones are great too. Um, but the Ombre Libre just has that extra kick uh, that the others do not. So um, if you are new to spicier cigars, I think this is a great introduction to them. Um, because it's not overwhelming, really does have a great flavor. Um, it's it's a very nice smoke, um, but you're going to get some of that pepper, some of that spice out of it. Um, you know, alternately, uh, if you like spicy cigars, uh, I think you'll love this one as well. Um, it won't be as heavily spicy as maybe some other ones that you like, um, but I think you'll agree that it's it's just it's got a nice kick, but it's smooth, got a nice flavor to it. Um, so it's a very enjoyable cigar. Um, yeah, I've smoked a lot of these since I've come across them this year, and uh, definitely uh, a favorite of mine when I can find them. So uh, it's about eight dollars retail. Um, so if you if you find a JFR Lunatic Ombre Libre, pick one up, check it out. Uh, I think you will enjoy it. So I'm gonna finish this up. Join me on the next cigar.